hello everyone this is a, a short video and uh, in this video i will show you that how to run a php artisan serve in a docker right okay so uh, here in my application you can see i already uh, in html directory but this is not html directory actual html directory this is just you can you can name it anything i mean you can uh, you can create a new folder and put application on this folder or application name you can say uh, and this is our application here the, all the application file and uh, let me show you the docker file when i show you the docker file you will understand uh, how can you uh, run this application in docker okay so vim docker file as you can see it's from PHP 7.2 that's mean it will uh, download a uh, PHP 7.2 from uh, docker hub then it will uh, run app get update minus y mean update the you know the container os and install open ssl and zip and unzip and git okay that's cool uh, because uh, it's running uh, debian or uh, debian uh, 10 maybe so that's why it's running apt get and also um, it's downloading uh, installer composer installer okay so here is this command so run mean it's a command so whenever uh, you want to run any command inside a docker container so you just type run and then your comment okay so that's it and uh, now this is Installing some PDO and MB string, PHP MB string, and a work directory. A work directory is so it will create a app folder. Inside the app folder, it will put, it will upload, or uh, yeah, it will upload all your files, your source files, your uh, application files into this directory. Okay, so that's mean dot because um the docker file inside your application so dot to uh, application uh, app folder and then it will run composer install and cmd php artisan serve host 000 why is that because otherwise it will run in localhost it it is also localhost but i want to say that if you uh, don't put this line so it will run under 127.0.0.1 which is a loopback address okay so if you if you type this one so you can you can access from any computer in your local network and port 8181 will be open so you can type any port here and expose 8181 means uh, that you can even use uh, 8181 from your browser so that's it now as you know the command how to run a docker container now as you know how to build a image a docker image like docker um, build minus t and uh, f or something give any name and also you can put your tag image tag and space and dot because you already in this folder otherwise you can use minus f and the path of the docker file okay and now hit the enter and it will create an image for you after that just run the docker images here you can see the image already created and uh, then run docker run command docker run minus d for the attachment mode minus it you can you can keep that also and uh, minus minus name give any name like admin uh, 5 or anything or on then minus p8181 because i already exposed this port 8181 so 8181 will be run inside the container and outside the container will be 8181 
ओके एंड ओके आई थिंक ऑलमोस्ट डन नाउ द इमेज आई डी ओके दैट्स इट ओके सो आई ऑलरेडी गिव पुट द नेम हियर As you can see, it's running here. Look at PS. See. So thank you for watching.